guys, it's Dave here, coming at you with another LEGO Star Wars review on the Home One Mon Calamani uh, Star Cruiser. Sorry about the pronunciation on that. Um, it has 789 pieces, ages 9 to 14 for the children, and its number is 7754. It is a 10th anniversary Fans Choice um, edition. So this was, I'll tell you a story later, but this is a special set. Uh, as always, we will start with the minifigures. Uh, the minifigures are great, just missing one thing. I'll tell you that when I'm doing the minifigure review, which is right now. Okay, starting off is with the A-Wing Pilot, new designed helmet. Very cool. Uh, it's different than the other ones. Not sure about the body. I think this is the same as the last A-Wing Pilot from 07 with the separate A-Wing. Um, he's pretty cool. Next is Emerald Akbar. He is definitely great. He's got a double-sided torso, very good amount of detail. The head is clearly amazing. It's solid rock. Watch, watch, watch. Watch this. I got a hammer. Whoops. No. <laughs> That's what I call an epic fail. Okay, we got his head. We got a hammer. Let's see what happens when I take the hammer and punch it on his head. Doesn't do anything. Still doesn't do anything. Now that's what I call hardcore plastic. Am I right? Anyways, so his head is definitely start, um, definitely great. Um... Like I said, body's good. Uh, could have been printed pants, but uh, from what I know, I don't think he has printed pants. So it's pretty good. Um, head is very well designed. There is a video on Toys R Us Online, that's a YouTube channel, that you can check out the set, and they look at the diagrams of how they built not only uh, the set, but the minifigure of Emerald Akbar. So check that out. That's also where you see two new Star Wars Battle Pack pictures. Also where I got that from. So check that out, guys, if you want to see more about the set. Uh, next is a Mon Calamari and uh, same head. I don't feel like demonstrating the hammer head. <laughs> hammer head, get it? Yeah, I suck at one-liners. Anyways, um, same head, uh, one-sided torso, sadly, no printed pants, but that's pretty cool, even though there's not as many features. It's great to have a non um, Mon Calamari. Uh, be nice if they put two of these in. I'll tell you that later in just a sec. Next is Mon Merit. I think that's how you say it. Mon Merit. Merit. Uh, it's both M O N M Mathen. Whatever that. I, I honestly don't know how to say her name. Sorry about that, guys. But I knew how to say it first. Dewey. Mine. But I have no clue how to say her last name. So don't comment about that. S shut up about crap like that. Um, one-sided torso, no printed pants, but she doesn't really have anything. White cape, that's nice, and Anakin's hair. I always knew that it was girly. Yeah, anyways, we got General Madden. Madden, I think that's how you say it. Uh, new colored hair and new facial hair, so that's great to see some of that stuff happening. Nothing too special about them. One sided torso and different color um, arms. Um, we got uh, Lando here, buddy. Lando would be, he's in two of the Star Wars episodes, five and six. Uh, mustache with a gray cape. You can use this gray cape for mm, probably a Grievous cape, I think. Just the only thing different if you didn't get that style of speeder bike is it just doesn't have that Republic red color. I do know that because I have it. Um, very, very detailed body on them, and different colored legs. On to the set, guys. Okay, there's two sections of this set. We'll start off with the first section. First section has the hologram of Endor. Breaks off just like that. Pretty darn easy. Uh, it's not the Death Star for one reason. There's no bented hole where the uh, super laser is, so that's how I know it's not the Death Star. These are the hologram uh, minifiers, and that's basically it for this part. This is actually the part where Leah and Han Solo and her and the general 
meet up and do that elite thing. This is not included in the set, just for display. So yeah. So what you do to unlock and make this into two sections is you pull this back and pull each other like that. Nothing was damaged, guys. Like, nothing. You may just hear like a snap sound, but that's it. So now we have the first section. Um, to the front, uh, very good detail in the doorway. You probably didn't see that. So let me zoom in. So really good um, detail on that. If we flip it over, we have this um, gizmo that allows Immortal Akbar. He sits in this chair. It's sort of cool how this works. And then there's this little control panel. Let me uh, bring up my tripod. Right there, and you have this spin gizmo right here that you can spin around. This is a feature in the movie, so this is great. Up here, you got a picture of the Death Star Super Laser. So, yeah, warning lights. I think those things go off. Um, this is the gizmo that how that um, the thing breaks in half, if you're wondering. And then, right here, there's controls on either side. This is where you need two of them. They only gave you one of them, there's supposed to be one here and there. So that's the only con that I know of with this set. So, and then you just take um control panel and you can do some stop motion. Yeah. And then right here we got of course Emma Akbar with his little control panel. It looks like something you might see on Luke's scanner when he's going in. Well not Luke this time, it's um 